video is brought to you by SoulfulThreads.com. Design your natural soul and hair care. Check us out for the latest in fashion, accessories, hair care, tutorials, and so much more. Again, that's SoulfulThreads.com with a Z. See you there. Hey YouTube, it's your girl, The Heartfelt Honey here, and I'm coming to give you my summer hair routine and what I'm going to be doing with my hair for the next, um... I guess two months since the summer will be wrapping up around the end of August, early September. But um, I've come to the decision that I, even though I love my tea tree and um, what is it? Tea tree triple treat shampoo from Giovanni's that I'll be trying a different um, conditioner um, throughout the summer and on until next year. I'm just gonna keep trying different conditioners because even though I love that, there might be something else out there that may even work better for my hair, but what I'll do is, as opposed to being like an all out and out product junkie, I've come up with this routine to kind of help me with that. Um, when I run out of one conditioner, I just go pick up another one of another sort that I already knew that I wanted to try. So I ran out of my triple treat after a while because you know I had the big, big, big bottle. Those of you, those of you who watch my channel know that. And so I went out and I got this Alba. It's something I have been wanting to try for a while. It's the Mango Moisturizing Hair Conditioner. And it, this is Hawaiian. And it's a pretty natural product. It has aqua, aloe, bardeninus. It has cedar alcohol but it also has glycerin and it has um, pineapple and it has a bunch of different papaya and different things in it. It does have um, methyl sulfate and it has a few cones but it's 100% vegetarian as you can see there and um, yeah, I, I put it on my hair, and as I always do, I deep condition once a week. So I put this on my hair, and I just left it on for like an hour. And so now I'm going to go in and start um, combing. I always wait until I let my conditioner sit for an hour before I start detangling my hair, which I find helps with, um, which I find helps with, um, retaining hair and not leaving so much hair as always those of you who know my know me and watch my channel i always use uh walmart bags instead of processing caps and i just tie them at the back of my head because i feel like um i'm getting more use out of the plastic bags than just um using them when i leave the grocery store or whatever um trying to be as green as possible trying to help be a benefit to our mother earth so I'm going to comb out a few of these and um, just let you know how I feel the slip is with this, condi this conditioner. And so far, so good. When I first put it on, um, it I, I rubbed it through and I kind of like finger detangled a little bit. And it wasn't bad. Um, I, the green, the, um, the Giovanni's, of course I'm comparing everything to Giovanni's. The Giovanni's, um, it, it's about the same slip as the Giovanni's. It's just a little, it's not quite the same slip. It's about the same, but it's not quite as, you know, it doesn't have the same amount of slip, which is why I'm spraying water on my hair now because I'm trying to make sure that I don't, you know, rip my, in, rip my hair out. So, um, yeah, it's not bad. It, do, would I buy it again? This is just the first time, so I'm going to use it a couple times before I make a um, a final decision on it but as of right now it's cool it's not like the best conditioner ever um, it was only seven dollars and forty seven cents at Walmart and um, so you can get it at Walmart it's convenient most people have Walmart so that's a good thing about it and um, yeah it's not a bad slip at all I'm combing right through not hearing any crack and snap, crackle and pop <laughs> like the um, cereal. <laughs> so, yeah, and this is all I got from that section. Can you see that? A little bit in my comb. So it's not bad for um, detangling. And I also should mention that this summer, too, I will um, be clarify washing my hair once a week. And I know some people that's going to be like, why is she, you know, shampooing her hair once a week? Well, 
when I do my hair, I tend to use a lot of um, products. So when I, um, in the summertime, by being so hot, I don't want there to be like a lot of buildup from me, you know, not washing all of that off. Like in the wintertime, your hair is a little dry, so you might leave a little bit on as opposed to like, you know, shampooing and clarifying every, like, every week. You might do it once a month or something like that, but with it being so hot, it's just things like, you know, it's this a lot, and I don't want too much gummy stuff, so I just, I wash all the shea butter and, um, shea butter and leave-in conditioner and stuff out of my hair after I'm done, um, once a week, just so I don't have, like, unnecessary product buildup, but as usual, I'm just going to twist, put this one section in, one big twist until I get ready to go wash all of the conditioner out. But I did want to come and give you guys that information about this Alba product and give you um, information about how I'm going to be treating my hair for the summer. Yep. Um, stay tuned because I have a review of the um, Herbal Essence Style Gel that I tried. And I wanted to share my experience with you guys. I tried it and I tried it, I think... I think I tried it twice and just stay tuned for the video. Okay, peace to you guys. Talk to you soon. If you have any questions, just let me know. Bye. Ugh. <laughs>